ACTS, ACTS, an acronym for the four specific ends of mass. A, adoration, C, contrition, T, thanksgiving, S, supplication. Let's take A, adoration. The primary and fundamental purpose and end of the holy sacrifice of the Mass is to adore God. St. Ignatius of Leola says that man is created to praise God, reverence God, serve God, and by means of that to save his soul. Adoration. The greatest means by which we can praise God is by offering God himself to God in the holy sacrifice of the Mass. And probably one of the best ways to exemplify the importance of adoring God is the part of Mass that we call the doxology. And here it is. The bread and wine has already been transformed into the body and blood of Christ. And it's the moment called the doxology, which the priest takes the host in his hands and the cup or chalice of the blood in another one of his hands. And he says, better yet, he sings, Through him, with him, and in him, Almighty God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. So we're lifting up Jesus Christ, the bread of life. We're praising God the Father. It's done through the power of the Holy Spirit. So we praise God the Father through the offering of God the Son, who is present in the consecrated host, in the consecrated chalice. But it's also done through the power of the Holy Spirit. So the primary purpose of Holy Mass is to praise God the Father. It's done through God the Son. And there is the power of the Holy Spirit.